Now, fearing the reversals that it is facing in the United States, Chinese video app TikTok is ready to get back at U.S. President Donald Trump on his crackdown of the app. TikTok has said that it will challenge the order by the American president in a court of law. Now, the Trump administration's crackdown on the popular Chinese-owned firm means that one of the U.S. companies can actually purchase out a state in the Chinese company. Now, in a statement, TikTok has put out it has said to ensure that the rule of law is not discarded and that our company and our users are treated fairly. We have no choice but to challenge the executive order through the judicial system. While TikTok is best known for its videos of people dancing and going wild as teenagers, U.S. officials have expressed concerns that information on users could in fact be passed on to China's communist government. The Washington has been accusing the controversial China-based app of being a national security threat. Therefore, the Trump administration has stepped up its efforts to get rid of what it deems to be untrusted Chinese apps from U.S. digital networks following which Trump administration has also issued an executive order on the 14th of August. The order gave TikTok owner ByteDance 90 days to shed the U.S. operations of TikTok. Highlighting a lack of due process, TikTok has also accused the Trump administration of not paying attention to facts and trying to insert itself into negotiations between private businesses. Now, Trump has said that he will support an effort by Microsoft to buy TikTok's American operations if the U.S. government got a substantial portion of the proceeds. TikTok will also be contesting its classification by the White House as a national security threat. But the White House has yet to comment on TikTok's intention to resort to legal action. The lawsuit will specifically challenge the 6th of August order, where Trump had used the International Emergency Economic Powers Act the act gives the president a broad array of powers to regulate economic transactions in case of a national emergency. Now, the 6th of August order directed the Secretary of Commerce to come up with a list of transactions involving ByteDance and its holdings that should be banned after a 45-day period, also making it illegal for U.S. companies to do business with TikTok. Now, TikTok has surged in popularity over the past year after it was purchased by the Chinese company ByteDance in the year 2017.